So what did you want to do today, my goddess? I want to fight monsters! Don't you think that's a little dangerous for someone of your... physical proportions? As long as I'm with you, my hero, I'm invincible! <laughs> my goddess, no! <laughs> you are so young and had such beautiful breasts and a nice personality or something, I don't know. But your breasts! Oh, Hestia! Who would do this to you? <laughs> The forest. What a place for a man like me to walk around with nothing but my cleaver and man purse to keep me. God, I need friends. <laughs> Stop screaming! That's better. So, what's a little girl like you doing out here all by yourself with a coffin that smells of blood? Oh, you poor thing. Can't even speak English. You must be one of those immigrant kids, the ones that are trying to get into this beautiful kingdom of ours and make a living. That must be why you're dressed like a maid. I got it! How about I take you in and you work for me? You can clean my house, make dinner, massage my feet, and you'll have a place to stay where I can keep you warm with my body on those cold, lonely nights, just like any master would do for their maid. Look! Over yonder, fair maiden! Tis a unicorn! I'ma slay it! Whoa! Now easy there, murder shot! Whoa! Daddy just wants to show you that murder is magic! Take that, Mother Nature! I can slay the ass of anything! Ah, now this is the life. A nicely cooked meal for all the hard work a man like me deserves after killing one of God's precious creations. Oh, this is really good. What part of the animal did you say this was again? Unicornio la polla! I have no idea what that means, but it must be fancy talk for delicious meat. Oh, dude, I didn't know you liked eating unicorn dick. <laughs> my goodness, never in my life have I seen so much vomit. Yeah, sorry about that. I'm the one sorry for ever letting you youngest cook in my kitchen. Now get the hell out of here before I call them cops on you. Oh, busted, bro. You know, you can jump in any time here and, uh, I don't know, uh, help pay for this? Sorry, bro, but as a man, I'm sure you can handle it. Damn it, this is all your fault, uh, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, what's your name again? Mi nombre es Chaika. Chiquita? No, mi nombre es Chaika. Chick Duck? Usted es un idiota. Right, anyways, a car. Chiquita, Chiquita, meet death with boobs. Bro, can I keep her? Sorry, Akari, but as the man of the house, I call first dibs. Well, now that you two are both acquainted, I'd like to give little Chiquita her first job, which is to help us rob a rich old man's house. Dude, that is excellent! Tengo un mal presentimiento sobre esto. Alright, we're in. How are you holding out there, Chiquita Banana? Alright, so far, so... Bloody hell, man! I do say I have a burglar in my house. And by the smell of things, he enjoys the fowls of the unicorn. Oh, come on! I do say, get the bloody hell out! Listen here, pub. We're gonna do this the easy way. We're gonna do this the manly way. Or, if I do say so myself, how about a good old contest for spawn? Yeah. On count of three, we pull out all weapons at once, and whoever has the most wins! You're on, Ganondorf! One, two, three! I'm 
totally screwed, aren't I? Most rambunctiously. Uh, how about two out of three? <laughs> Dude, I cannot believe that you ran away crying like a little baby. Hey, you think if I cut off my tongue with this thing, it'll get the taste of unicorn dick out of my mouth? Whoa, 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 dude. Are you serious? Yeah, you're right. That is a pretty dumb idea. I'll just have to wait until after I eat. Uh, yeah, dude. I mean, even I could have thought of that. Besides, the little dude that's working hard right now to make us something special to eat as a thank you for taking her in. If she's gonna feed me animal testicles again, I swear to God, I will beat her. Nah, dude. By the way, she explained this meal is gonna have a real explosion of flavor. So, being the big sis that I am to the little dude, I decided to help her out and speed up her baking. <laughs> Well, little dude, it gotta hand it to you. You totally were kidding about that explosive part. Or again.